Okay, I'm going to show you how to make the heart. The heart of all the shapes is the hardest to put together. Basically, you have two edges. You have a slanted edge and you have a straight edge. And the rule, generally, is that the straight edges go together and the slanted, slanted edges go together. Uh, in this particular case, we're going to break that rule many times. Alright, to start off with the first piece, you follow the rule and you interlock the first two pieces. But then, you bend it and you're going to connect these two pieces here. You have to hold it in place though, so that it doesn't pop out or fall apart for the first little bit. Now we're going to start by creating a little button here. And we're going to go with the straight edge, right down the middle there. Another straight edge, right down the middle. Alright, so there you go. We're going to do the other side. Straight edge, just like that. We'll hook it there. Another straight edge, right down the middle. What's unique about the heart is that it's always going to be exactly symmetrical. Exactly. All the way across. Okay, we'll continue. We're going to do again a straight edge right down the middle. So the front part of the heart is exactly like the back side. Again, straight edge. Hook it. Again, straight edge. Hooks right there. And there we have that piece. And we're just going to continue. The way you make the heart is actually in three separate pieces. And this is the first piece. And it's actually um, the hardest piece. So again, a straight edge right down the middle. We're creating these buttons here. And there we have that. We'll do the other side. Again, straight edge right down the middle. They're exactly symmetrical. And now look at that. Okay, you got that. Now we're going to complete the side here. And it's again, it's a straight edge. Straight edge right down the middle, right there. That completes that part. And then again, a straight edge on the button there. And again, a straight edge right on the button right there. Okay, now because the heart's exactly symmetrical, we're going to do the same thing to the other side. Again, straight edge right there. And then again, a straight edge right on that button. There we go, hook those two, and again, straight edge right there. And there we have the middle section completely done. So we're going to set that aside for now. There's the last image of it, make sure you got it right. So there's the front of the heart. So you have one, two, three buttons, and then a fourth one right there, and that'll be where it bends in again. The other side will be exactly the same. And those are the sides. You can see kind of the wave formation there. You should have the wave formation like that. All right, we're going to set it aside. OK, now, if you're familiar with this, what we're about to make is a half cylinder. If you've ever made a cylinder before, this will be easy. We're going to start with just the five star on bottom. You can do any color pattern you want, but you're going to start with the five star, just like that. And we're going to continue, just like if you're building a sphere. It's exactly how this goes. The first ten pieces are exactly like a sphere.
have it. Ten pieces there. And those. And so you should have three button there. Just three of the five flower there. And then the three flower completed all the way around. Okay, now is where we break the rule. And you're going to do a straight edge right there. Right onto each of these uh, three flowers that are not completed. Take a straight edge and hook it on. It's just like if we're doing a cylinder. If you've ever done a cylinder, this is exactly how you do it. And there. And the last one here. Do that one again, last one right here. So there we have, you see it's sort of collapsing a little bit towards the middle. So what we're going to do though, take another straight edge, right like that, and that will give it the support it needs to form kind of a cylinder shape. And you just go all the way around here. Again, straight edge on all of these, and you're making four flowers there. So you're definitely breaking the rule when you do this one. And one more here. And there you have it. So it's a half cylinder for anyone who's familiar with the cylinder. It's a half cylinder. You're going to have four flowers all the way around there. All right. We're going to set it aside and we're going to make one exactly like it. And I'm going to do this pretty fast here. So um, you might have to look at the other one if you want a slower one. Again, making the five flower on bottom. Just continuing as we would a uh, normal sphere, just hooking them in. And there you have that. Just like a normal sphere, and then we're gonna do the straight edges on the three, the, uh, the ones that should be the five flowers. Go. Keep hooking that up. Just continue along here. Okay, again, it sort of collapsed in on itself. So we're going to continue around here. a half cylinder. And there we have it. A half cylinder. Alright, so this is what we have left. We have two cylinders and then the body right here, okay? Now the first step we're gonna do is connect the two cylinders. So you take your last piece here, and it's a straight edge, just like that. And you just hook it in and hook it in, and then these will hook together just like that, okay? They're a little bit tricky, you gotta bend them. That's the thing about the heart, is you do have to bend the pieces quite a bit. 
and there we go. So we got the two half cylinders, and you can kind of see it where a heart would begin to form. That's they're going to actually end up bending, and you can kind of see where a heart would be there. So, okay. Now comes the fun part. This is where it really gets tricky. See, uh, here's this piece. See this point here? This point is going to hook up to that point right there. So those are going to connect, okay? And that can be tricky. You can kind of see those points are going to connect. And then this point and this point are going to connect. And this point and that all white point right there is going to connect. And, uh, oops. This point is going to connect right inside there. And that's when you have to bend it, okay? So first things first. Bear with me if this goes out of the frame or you can't see. We're hooking that one to there. We hook that to there. Now we really start to bend it at this point. And things are going to start popping out and you just have to just pop them back in. Alright. And... go. So we've got those ones in there and we're going to just continue. At that point you can kind of see where things start to align and you just connect them. Connect that one to there. Connect this one right there and I apologize if this is going out of the frame sometimes. And those connect right there. This one We'll connect right there, and this guy is right here, so we're back on the other side now. So these two are going to connect right there, those two connect right there, and these guys connect in the middle. Remember, they're exactly symmetrical as the other side, so it should look exactly like now this is a tough one because you just have to connect in and do these one at a time you see I'm really having to bend this and that's usually how it is with the heart There we go. Okay, as you see, it's kind of tricky. Okay, so we just got a few pieces more to button up. And just, I mean, keep in mind this while you're doing this, other parts are going to pop out of place, and you just continue to go around and, and put them in place. It's uh, no surefire way to make it. Okay, last couple pieces here. And you can really see where they where they hook in. Um, it's actually quite obvious where they're supposed to go. Okay, and we're down to the last pieces here. And then I'm bring this one up. I'm going to bend it. Really good. There we go. And ta-da! It's a heart. There it is. I'll give you a good close up of it so you can see. So those are the four buttons. One, two, three, and four right there. It's gonna be exactly the same on this side. One, two, three, and then four right there. And uh, you can see the sides there, also the side buttons there. There it is, and uh, there it is. So it's a heart, but you know, you turn it sideways, it kind of looks like a boot, too. And there you go. That's it.